accused of plotting to murder four other people, including a Cherokee County judge, appeared in court today. Two News reporter Brandon Richards spoke with relatives of one of the men charged. It's only on two. Well, the four defendants appeared in court today for their preliminary hearing. One of them turned state's witness. Meanwhile, the family of another describes the last two months as very painful, unable to speak with their son. When District 27 Drug Task Force agents raided this Telequa apartment, they found something they weren't expecting, a hit list written on a note card. Agents say it mentioned four people as targets, including a Cherokee County judge. All four mentioned are involved in a child custody dispute. Agents say on the other side of that dispute, 19-year-old Martina Williams. In testimony today, defendant Raymond Giss said Williams' fiance Samuel Chadwick, along with her sister Joanna Ashcroft, asked if he could carry out the hits. Giss says he agreed to for $300, but never acted on it. In fact, he says he started working with police to set the other three defendants up. Not surprising at all. He's doing what he has to for himself. While Giss' testimony didn't surprise Samuel Chadwick's mother, she says the jail not allowing her son to contact his family did. You know, we can't even find out if he's doing okay. You know, we can't even ask that. She calls her son a good person, whose main focus was protecting those he cares about. He's uh, very caring, very loyal to his friends, very protective of his friends and family. He's just not that type of person to, you know, go out and do something against someone like that. Now, all four defendants face several counts. The two men are expected back in court on August 21st. The two sisters expected back in September. Reporting in Tahlequah, Brandon Richard, 2 News works for you.